Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Wendy, aka Kitty Street, and it's a fall, y'all. And it also is still a spooky September, and I have some seasonal things, some home decor, lots and lots of food, mostly candy, but it's that time of the year, and let's just jump right on into this haul. Um, this, what I'm about to show you, is something that I had my eyes on for quite a while. They, You can always see these or colors of these in any most of the Dollar Trees that you go to, but I just wouldn't break down and buy the set because I wanted, I actually wanted six of each of them, but I only bought four because I just second guess myself again but i went ahead and said you know what i what am i waiting for um i can use these pieces over and over and over again so the first one is this uh, cute little bowl i mean i never have bowls like this at all it's a pretty good size it's by that royal norfolk norfolk excuse me um it is a microwave and a dishwasher safe um made in china and it is just kind of like a different shape to it um, I love the way it's made. I love the base of it. I wanted to uh, set a table up. I um, decided I'm going to do the black and white theme. I just don't know. I was like rambling on about it. And I said, yes, you're just going to do it. So I'm probably going to do like a uh, kind of a spooky table with the black and white setup. I think I'm still on the fence about that. But so I didn't get not one. I got two. And then I got the three. And then I got number four. And I'm going to tell you, this right here is a very heavy. Um, check out, now not all of them are, you know, great. Some of them are real flimsy, kind of, you know, cheatsy looking. But these right here are very nice. And I made sure I went through them and picked out the best ones. And they are glass. So I picked out four of those. I'm probably going to go back and get two more just to have a set of six. I don't know what I was thinking. So I picked up those bowls. Then I also picked up the counterpart of the little um, flat trays, the little um, small saucery kind of things, I guess what you want to call it. It's also by the Royal Norfolk. Um, this one just calls us a plate. I don't think these had anything on the bottom of them. Oh yeah, they did. These were just said bowl and these just say plate, <laughs> but they're, you know, if you put them together, I'm not going to set them on top of each other or nothing like that. I'm actually going to set them beside each other and I've got some whimsical kind of um, silverware stuff I'm going to put out like a centerpiece um, for a decor piece for the the spooky Halloween season so I got one then I got this one here with these in between little pieces let me move this um, two for that and I, like I said I went through them and picked out the best ones I could then I got the third one and then I got the fourth one okay so I thought those were awesome um, for $1.25, I got a set of dishes. Um, yeah, I probably could have went somewhere else and bought a whole set for maybe on the cheap, but I wanted these particular ones. I like the way they feel, and I was drawn to them. I just procrastinated and kept putting it off and kept putting it off and kept putting it off. So I'm going to show you some um, food items, and then I'm going to go back into some more dishes, home decor stuff that I also was like I'm buying more of these. I bought only one of them last year and when I saw them, whatever it is about this detail of it, I think it's going to be awesome for Halloween and for Thanksgiving and you can do so many different things with it. But with that said, let me tell you guys, I have been seeing people hauling these and I went ahead on a whim and picked them up as well. It's this limited editions Werther's Original. And this one here, these are the ones that everybody's been putting out there. This is the pumpkin spice and everything nice, not sugar-free. Um, I don't even want to look at the calorie count here and the carb count, but this isn't really for me. This is for me. I got, I have some little um, candy dishes. Um, I, I've got um, a pumpkin thing that I, was, that I was going to throw some candies in for, you know, when I have guests over. And hopefully I won't get into too many of them, but Pumpkin spice is here. It is fall, y'all. And I kind of wasn't on, you know, thinking, should I get this? Should I get this? Because there's, this is nothing. It starts right here. And when you go to the back, it says five pieces is a serving. And there's only two servings, which means there's only 10 pieces in here. But because I do um, usually have my family over and it's a pretty big crowd, for Thanksgiving, I think that's the one they stuck me with because it's also around my birthday. Um, but I usually have people come over to my house. I don't know if it'll be the same thing this year. We haven't got to that that point of talking about it yet. 
but um, I know that the other people love pumpkin spice and the other ones I'm about to show you. So I'm going to tell you this one is good till May of 2023. Um, so there's only 10 in here, but I'm going to mix and match them with these others. So I got the pumpkin spice one. Then we got these salted caramel creams. Same thing. Um, two servings, which is five pieces, which means there's only about 10 of them in there. Um, this one's good till April of 2023, if you can see that right there. And these are the soft Werther's Originals, okay? And these are the salted caramel creams. It says they're new. This one here doesn't have the new on it, so maybe that came out last year. I don't know. But um, I kind of like salted caramel in my coffee, so I'm thinking it'll be good to mix and match as well as in there. Then, you know, you got to have your maple cream. This is also another limited edition. Um, this one here is, again, 10 pieces, two servings, five pieces a piece. Good till April of 2023. This is Harvest Caramels Maple Cream. Um, it looks pretty doggone cute right there in the little picture. Um, it says the Old World Recipe Limited Edition. Um, they are all 2.22 ounces. That's a great number. Let me see if this one said, yeah, old world recipe. So you got the pumpkin spice. We've got the salted caramel creams. And now we've got the maple cream, all 2.22 ounces. And then we have the caramel apple, which this is one I'm definitely going to try because I've never had the caramel apple and I happen to love caramel apples. They're, that's the only way I eat apples is got caramel all over it or chocolate or something like that. It's crazy. Um, it's uh, good until May of 2023. And these are the old world recipe as well. Um, and it just basically looks delicious. And I'm going to be mixing all of these together in one little um, candy dish. And again, these are the caramel apples. And all of these ones I just showed you are the soft shoes which leads me to this one now this one because i told you i like the caramel apples i picked up on a whim last minute they had so many different ones of the hard ones they even had sugar-free ones but i still have a couple of sugar-free soft shoes that I'll, I'll eat during the holidays too as well because i only try to eat a couple of them at a time but this here is the hard um candies with the uh car the apple caramel apple filled hard candies um it's it says apple field right here um and it's this one has a little bit more in it it's 2.65 ounces and it's good till june of 2023 but i'm actually going to mix all of these candies in a candy dish and i'm going to set them out for um you know mix them all together so when they pick them up i don't know if they can tell by the wrapper whatever you get you'll get and hopefully it'll be a fun thing for the holidays but i didn't stop there i went to my niece's birthday slash graduation and my sister had these tootsie rolls in vanilla which i knew you could buy these but my goodness i did not know how great tasting they were this is a random bag i the only one i saw because if i would have saw another one i probably would have picked up a second one to give out for trick-or-treat candies um but these are the midge midgies i think that is what it's saying vanilla flavored um, Tootsie Rolls. This is a 5.83 ounce bag, brand name, brand name bag. And like I said, it was the only one I saw. And I even looked at the date of it. It says it's good till June of 2024. So it's nothing to do with, um, you can't even see that. It's right there, real light, um, to do with it being old. But I, I hunted the whole, well, this whole store in particular I was in um, because I'm also going to mix this in here with the. Um, other creams just to have it a little bit of color okay so i picked up one of those for a dollar 25 and i think i'm good for some little snacky candies for that okay let me show you these right here i don't know again i i think it's something to do with the trimming of it it's like this rustic antique it almost reminds me of like old italy it's just, I just love it. I love the little ball up here. I love the way the tray is. I had um, the I had bought one last year and I went ahead and bought two this year because I have a three tier situation thing that I stack little things on and I put like old bottles and just, just different decors and things like that. So I bought two of these. They're just charger plates that are in this, this um, I guess it's like a vertical rectangle. I don't even know what the shape of it is. It's not telling me what it is. 
or what sizes is, but this detailing I thought is so cool, not only for Halloween, but also for Thanksgiving to put out decor. And then I went ahead and I don't remember how many I bought. I bought one, two, three, four, five. Wait, one, two, three, four. Yeah, because I already had one of these from last year. I, like a ding dong, I only bought one. Uh, these here are the charger plates. Um, let me turn around this way. Um, this same detail, but of course this is a charger plate and it's in a circular uh, situation instead of the one that I just showed you. Um, I was reading to see if it was dishwasher safe, but it doesn't say. It says, yeah, it does right here. It says for de decorative purposes only, which I'm only going to use it to do as centerpieces. But I wanted six. That's why I don't know why I didn't get six of the, the bowls and the, the little saucers there. I don't even know what I was thinking. But look at the, you know, they have all types of these, but this one here is a very, this is not cheap. And I have chargers of every color. I don't have six of every color, but this one right here was worth me to get six of them. Usually I, I have one or two. I usually put one centerpiece on the middle of my main table and just do some kind of decorative thing on one charger because they take up so much room. But when I take out the leaf of my table, my kitchen table, it makes it longer. And then I can do like a whole table set up. And sometimes I'll do that randomly at different seasons. And this year I'm gonna do it at Halloween and do some decor. I got those little wiggly eyes and some icing and things. I'm gonna make some black and white cupcakes because I'm pretty sure I'm going to do black and white. I'm almost 99% sure of that at this point for my decorations this year because I'm just leaning towards that. I mean, I'll probably have some colors here and there, but the majority is going to be black and white. But these right here, like I said, it might even be thrown in here with a little bit of this in there as well. I'm not sure, um, but for Halloween, I'm gonna do a whole tablescape and I cannot wait to do that. I thought these were great. So I got not one, but five of these chargers. I'm not gonna show you every single one of them and it will go with the other one that I have already to make a total of six, which is awesome. So I got all of that. And then finally, well, let me show you these two. This is the, this is the kind of color scheme that I had in my head since really, um, I guess, February, March, February-ish of this earlier this year. I kept saying this Halloween, I mean, this Thanksgiving, I want to have these colors. And this is the colors of the, this like a, you know, little turquoise blue, um, the kind of amberish, not necessarily the bright oranges, but the amber and this white or maybe even gray. And I found this pack of napkins. There's 14 of them in there. It says um, there's they're 30 by 40 inches, and it's distributed by the Green Bar Industries. But I love, I mean, I literally love the way this looks. I like the little pattern on the bottom here. So I'll be putting these out. And then I had gotten the smaller pack, which complements it. It's a little bit different. It has majority of those colors in there as well. So I'm going to be doing some kind of looking things with these napkins for $1.25. You know, you know, you can get napkins here and there, and I never hardly buy these ever, but when I see something that draws in my attention and it's just exactly what I had in my head, I'm like, oh yeah, I'm definitely gonna be doing that color scheme for sure. So that leads me to the baby pumpkins. I finally got my hands on them. I'm gonna do each one of them, but I'm gonna show you, I got several ones of them, and I'm gonna talk about each one of them right quick, all the colors, because I, I only had, and I thought I, I completely, and I said I was gonna get it, I hauled uh, a blue one, a baby blue one, which is probably the color of this right here, which was one of the first ones I found because it was the only one my store had in this right here of the baby blue. And I said, I need to find some pink ones because I got some of those pink pumpkin sweater picks that you stand up that were pink and blue. And I said, I'm gonna get it there. So I did, let's just start off well. I just, one just popped off. I hope that's not broken. Oh my goodness. Well, I'm glad, you know, be careful with them. And I have been hauling these in my car. Okay, it popped right back on. Um, okay, so, and I'll hot glue that for sure. But these are the ones that have the little um, clips on it, which is awesome because you're not trying to twine them up or, you know, if you lay them on something, they don't roll off. Um, I don't have to hot glue them because if you hot glue something and it's just a mess, if you don't want to use it again, um, pulling it off, it's like a mess, excuse me. And I, I said, you know, I'm going to have individual things because I may want to do something different. And, you know, I love colors, so I'm gonna put, I have different boxes with that organize my color of all my seasonal stuff for the majority. So this one here is the Crafter Squares three piece. 
Again, they had the little clips on them back here. And this is that beautiful um, baby pink. And they are kind of the soft little uh, material that they have there. And they have the cutest little um, stems right there. And I said, this is so good. It says velvet pumpkin clip. And this is the baby pink one. And then I got this one right here, which leads into the kind of, it's more like a, it's a little, it's not the bright orange, which they had the bright orange, but I just was want, I just really wanted this. I want, I want to call this a burnt orange. I think I'm going to call it like an amber. And it kind of reminds me of, you know, these, the stems and things like that on this. So that kind of got there. So this one here is the same thing by Crafter Square, Velvet Pumpkins, three piece. And it has the clips and I thought they were pretty cute. Um, if you can see those colors, um, I just thought they were different and vibrant and I don't have any pumpkins that color. And then this one blew me away. I am just in love with this color. I bought a few tops in this color for the winter this year. It's like a deep teal, I guess. I don't know what the color it is, um, but it is so beautiful. Crafter Square, you are on point. Dollar Tree, you're on point. Um, all of these colors right here are definitely going to be in my fallscape, and I can set them around the table. Um, you know, some people like to do different things. I think this is something I can use all the, for different situations, and I will have them year after year after year. And last but not least, I had to hone it back in because I wanted every color. They had all kinds of this fake um, leather this is the leather pumpkin clips. Again, Crafter Square, three pieces. Guys, this right here is the only leather one I bought. They had white ones, they had black ones, they had gray ones, they had a different type of brown. Um, I wanted all of them and I had all of them, but then I sat back and said, you know what? <laughs> calm down. You know, you're not going to get all of these. Um, I'm going to second guess myself later for not getting them, but you know, there'll be diff something different next year. So I have to save it, you know, if I'm going to add on to my collection, but these right here, um, I, I had hauled back and they even go well with this back centerpiece. Um, and it just matches these colors here a little bit more than the other ones did. And I said, I'm going to just get four of them. And I limited myself. Plus I have the blue ones that I didn't bring here that I said I was going to bring and show you as well that I already hauled in a previous video a while back when they first came out. And this just now came to my stores. And you know, you cannot wait too much to um, you know, November, listen, falls now, if you don't get this stuff and I have been buying stuff here ever since the, probably the end of July or maybe even before, as soon as they started putting them out, I started buying little things that I knew I was going to put up around, um, this year and the colors that I wanted to do. Cause if you wait too long, you may not get what you want. Okay. All right. Then I did get this right here. They had a, another one that was kind of like a wider, more iridescent one. Um, I only got one and I, I have something I want to do because I'm doing a little um, triage, little background thing with a, a flower arrangement. And I said, this would be perfect to sit beside it, like up elevated. Um, and it has the little uh, leaf. Um, isn't that just gorgeous? And they did have another color, but I only got one because I, I wasn't quite sure that this was going to match all my colors. I was trying to I had forgotten about my flower arrangement and what color it was. So I said, I know that this one's pretty much the colors. So I'm going to get this and I just love it. And this actually comes off, I think. I know it does because I pulled it out. Well, I'm not going to break it, but goodness, it's in there. I pulled it out once, but there we go. Wow, it is, it is in there. So if you want to put something in there, I'm probably not. Um, but yeah, this, this is a sturdy piece of glass, not cheap stuff here. It just says a bottle and I'm thinking I'm going to call it an amber color cause it's just so pretty and the detailing is so cool and it doesn't tell me dimensions or anything. It just says bottle and distributed by the Greenbrier industry. So I picked up uh, that bottle right there. Then I got this little hello fall, um, square, um, container. Um, it is not dishwasher safe and it is not microwavable safe, but I actually got, I have get these when they come out with the design. And of course, you know, the, the fall and the, the little truck is always in season is in, in style. I got this to put, um, little things in it like treats, cupcakes. I mean, sometimes you can't get a cupcake here cause it's too big, but rice, crispy, rice, crispy treats. Um, I last haul, I did a bunch of those little, um, bags with the candies in it and so like that. Um, anything you can put in here, um, 
you can put this and you can leave it out and people can come by and snap it off and get them whatever they're going to get out of there and put it back up and it is a fall festival right i thought this was cute and for a dollar 25 it's still great it is for decor only so do not put this in the, the microwave or the dishwasher because it will <laughs> be done all right one last item i went down the dollar plus aisle again and wow wow and wow now i did get my skull um a bag for three dollars many many months ago and i hauled that and i just put them there because that one's going to go out on my front porch with some random candies in there and i'm thinking about putting some dry ice in there around it to let it kind of be spooky but i haven't decided yet but there are so many <laughs> things i want to buy in that dollar plus um aisle for halloween and for thanksgiving and for fall and i was like okay stop 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 what what's your budget because i do honestly go in and say this is what you are allowed to spend and you better make big use of it don't just be frivolous let it be good pieces like dishes or decor that you can use over and over again or you know something you're going to share with your family and friends so i walk walked through and i said i'm going to buy one item and i walked the, the aisle because sometimes they're in aisles sometimes they're spread out but this particular store was one whole one row one long row of um nothing but the five three and five dollar items so i had saw these signs and i had been looking at them and looking at them and i almost bought one when they first came out that said i think it said maybe blessed or welcome or whatever and i said nope I, if i get one i'm going to get a real sturdy one to keep outside all year all year long so it will you know hold up with the elements and these were they just look kind of cheap well this was you know i think the dollar plus has been out well over a year now i don't even know when it came out but it's been out a minute so i said to myself self when i saw this one random sign it wasn't even with the signs it was actually somewhere else in another whole area because i went through the aisle and i had like two or three items um i'll tell you what i had i had a little cauldron that that you could put um dry ice in that was cute i had a couple i, I had two, a three dollar sign and a five dollar i mean a three dollar candle candle and a three dollar sign which is a little bit more than the five dollars and then i had um a mat one of those really good thick mats not like the ones that are dollar 25 and then I went around the corner and I put all that back because I found this one <laughs> sign and I'm going to come back because it's something with this black and white stuff and it says, Hey, boo. <laughs> and when I saw this, I said, I'm going to get this because I say this to my daughter all the time. It doesn't have to even be how I'm like, Hey, boo. <laughs> Hey boo, hey boo. It's just a, a really fun little saying and there is some little things wrong with it. I noticed right off the bat, it had a little chip right there. I'm gonna have to paint it with a black, I'll probably use a black Sharpie and spruce it up. But this is a 48 inch leaner. Can you see that right there, leaner? And it was $5. Um, it's distributed by the Greenbrier Industries and it is, you know, just a, a plain thing. Now, if I decide to ever interchange it, you can pop these out. I, I could see real quickly you could do that and I could do some other design. But this right here will be something that I will keep. Let me see if it'll stick right there. And it's Hey Boo. So with that said, I'm gonna say bye boos and I hope you guys enjoyed this haul today. Um, yeah, it's fall y'all and it is Halloween time. So I am going to be doing some house decorating and I'm gonna be doing a lot of crafting with Dollar Tree products. So with that said, you know if you haven't subscribed, I'm just wondering why. And I'm teasing you guys. I, I appreciate you from the deepest of, of my soul for you um, supporting my channel. And if you hung out this long, you know, go ahead and subscribe if you haven't. Because, you know, you need to see this content. The Dollar Tree, if I'm not showing it to you, I know you can see other people showing it to you. But you need to see it regardless. So why not just go ahead and subscribe, right? I love you guys. I appreciate your um, support again. And like, share, and comment. And until the next one, take care. Bye.